Hey everyone, this is Bob the Science Guy. You know, the other day I challenged Flat Earth scholars to use the formula 8 inches per mile squared and tell me what the calculated drop in Earth curve would be at 3 eighths of a mile. Let's go ahead and grab a piece of paper and do it. Now the equation 8 inches per mile squared describes a hyperbola or a parabolic arch. And the formula for that is y equals a, which is some constant of proportionality, times x squared. Now, because this curve opens downward, we have to put a negative in front of it because we're talking about a drop. Now, to figure out what we're doing here, just imagine a spherical Earth, and we're draping a curtain or a sheet over it. That sheet will form this parabolic shape. And again, the formula for that is some proportional constant called a times x squared. And again, we have 8 inches per mile squared, and that is the drop. Now, the challenge that I gave them is tell me what, according to this calculation, the drop at 3 eighths of a mile would be. Here, I've set the problem up. We have 8 inches times 3 eighths squared will equal the drop. Let's do the math. So here's how you would set that up. You square the 3, or in other words, multiply 3 by 3, and then you put it over the square of 8, which is 8 times 8. Now, conveniently, these two 8s will cancel, and our drop will equal 9 over 8 inches, or 1.125 inches. And that is the calculated drop of Earth curve over 3 eighths of a mile. Subscribe to my channel for more remedial math. This is Bob the Science Guy. See you soon.